Now that their nominations are secure, Joe Biden and Donald Trump are in general election mode. But as Rebecca Castor reports from Washington, Trump has to juggle the campaign trail with court appearances. It might look and sound like a campaign rally, but it's actually Donald Trump arriving at a Florida courthouse for yet another hearing. Trump! Trump did nothing wrong! Thursday, a judge heard arguments on whether to dismiss charges, accusing the former president of holding on to classified documents after he left the White House. President Biden faced a similar scenario after investigators found classified material at his home from his time as a senator and vice president. But in a controversial decision, a special counsel chose not to prosecute. And the special counsel just sort of shrugged and said, well, we probably couldn't secure, secure a conviction in D.C. President Trump's going to play on that, and I don't blame him. While Trump was tied up in court, President Biden is trying to win over minority voters in Michigan, touting his economic plan to lower costs for the middle class. Meanwhile, Vice President Harris is ensuring reproductive rights stay in the spotlight this election, visiting a Planned Parenthood in Minnesota Thursday, the first known visit for a sitting president or VP to an abortion clinic. These attacks against an individual's right to make decisions about their own body are outrageous and in many instances just plain old immoral. President Biden and Vice President Harris plan to visit every battleground state this month. Trump's next stop is a rally in Ohio this weekend. In Washington, Rebecca Castor, Fox News.